Once upon a time in a small village nestled between towering mountains, there lived a young boy named Aiden. Aiden had a dream that burned brighter than the sun that warmed his village every morning. He wanted to become the greatest mountaineer the world had ever seen. From a very early age, Aiden had been drawn to the majestic peaks that surrounded his home. Their snow-capped summits reached into the heavens, and their sheer cliffs dared anyone to conquer them. As a child, Aiden would sit on a rock, gazing up at the mountains, envisioning himself standing at their peaks. Aiden's parents were simple farmers who couldn't understand his fascination with the mountains. They urged him to focus on more practical pursuits, but Aiden's dreams were unshakable. He started practicing his climbing skills on the hills around his village, tying ropes to trees and scaling the rocky terrain with determination. As he grew older, Aiden's skills improved, but he knew that to achieve his dream, he needed proper training and guidance. One day, he gathered his courage and set off on a journey to find a legendary mountaineer named Master Kale. It was said that Master Kale had conquered the most treacherous peaks and possessed knowledge that could turn an ordinary climber into a legend. Aiden's journey was filled with trials and tribulations. He faced harsh weather, treacherous terrain, and moments of self-doubt. But his determination was unwavering. After many months, he finally reached the remote dwelling of Master Kale. Master Kale was an elderly man with a twinkle in his eye and a deep, soothing voice. He agreed to take Aiden as his apprentice but made it clear that the path to greatness would be long and grueling. Aiden gladly accepted the challenge. Under Master Kale's guidance, Aiden honed his skills. He learned to read the mountains like a book, deciphering the subtlest signs of danger and opportunity. He became one with the elements, understanding the wind's whispers and the snow's secrets. Day after day, he climbed higher, pushing the boundaries of what he thought was possible. But as he climbed, Aiden faced setbacks. He encountered storms that threatened to blow him off the mountainside and crevasses that seemed impossible to cross. There were moments when he questioned his abilities and wondered if he would ever reach the summit of his dreams. Master Kale, however, was always there to inspire him. He shared stories of his own struggles and triumphs, reminding Aiden that greatness was not achieved without adversity. He taught Aiden that true strength came from within, that the heart of a climber was as important as the strength of their limbs. Years passed, and Aiden's skills grew to legendary proportions. He became known as the Mountain Whisperer for his ability to conquer peaks that had once been deemed impassable. But Aiden's ultimate challenge lay ahead, the tallest, most treacherous mountain in the world, Mount Evercrest. The ascent of Mount Evercrest was nothing short of a battle against nature itself. Aiden and Master Kale faced avalanches, blizzards, and oxygen-deprived altitudes that threatened to steal their breath. But they pressed on, inching closer to the summit with every step. On the fateful day they reached the peak, the world seemed to hold its breath. Aiden stood at the pinnacle of his dreams, tears of joy and exhaustion streaming down his face. He had done it. He had conquered the unconquerable. But as Aiden gazed out at the breathtaking vista from the summit, he realized that his journey was not just about reaching the top of a mountain. It was about the resilience he had discovered within himself, the unwavering spirit that had carried him through the darkest storms. Aiden descended Mount Evercrest as a true legend, but he never forgot the lessons of humility and perseverance that Master Kale had taught him. He returned to his village not only as the greatest mountaineer the world had ever seen but as a living testament to the power of dreams and determination. And so, Aiden's story became an inspiration to countless others, a reminder that greatness could be achieved by anyone willing to climb their own personal mountains with unwavering resolve. His journey had proved that the only limits that truly existed were the ones we placed on ourselves. 
In the end, Aiden's legacy was not the mountains he had conquered but the hearts he had inspired to reach for the skies, to climb their own Everest, whatever it might be. His story served as a timeless reminder that the human spirit was boundless and that the path to greatness was open to all who dared to dream and persevere. Thanks for watching. Mike Nova YouTube channel. Like, comment, share and subscribe.